Welcome to Westchester, and we are the Westchester Girls. So today, I'm finally going to set Nicole up on that matchmaking episode we've been talking about. I really thought it was a joke, and then they threw me in her office for an hour. What can I say? Today you're finally going to hopefully get your man. Or, you know, since Cindy wasn't doing any good. We're going oh to do it. You probably had Cindy help you. We'll see. We'll just have to oh wait until boy. these uh, questions are all done. How do I know Hysterical Patrick's not over there? I'm going to have to wait and see, so uh, I'm going to introduce the contestants to you, okay? Oh, God. You guys ready? Okay, contestant number one. Give me an interesting fact about yourself. I'm just here living in the ether, man, just like everybody else. I'm just trying to go through life and just, uh, just keep going. Riveting. Just keep going. Art, okay. art is everything. Yeah. I will die for it. That's good to know. <laughs> okay, contestant number two, can you tell me an interesting fact about yourself? Um, I'm say personally that I'm uh, really cultured. I've been abroad just to let everybody know, so uh, that's my interesting fact. Okay, fine. Contestant number three? I'm not quite as cultured, but I'm a Fredonia native, so that's kind of interesting. Okay, that's more interesting than us since we're from Westchester. I don't know. So that actually brings to my next question, guys. Where are you from? One, first. I don't identify with a home, so um, I can't answer that. I'm just living in the ether. Oh, okay. I really, okay. <laughs> yep, that's, okay, we'll move on. Um, uh, I'm from, I'm from Rochester. Some people call it Rochester, but it's mostly Rochester. Are you really? Yeah. I don't know, your accent doesn't really fit. Your accent sure, doesn't Are you fit. sure you're not from Rochester? Are you sure you're not from Westchester? I'm from Westchester. I don't know what to tell you. Okay, number three. Where are you from? Oh, you said born, it. Born in Buffalo, but grew up in Fredonia. Oh, yeah. okay. Well, that makes for an interesting life compared to us. So, we'll <laughs> sure get to does. you later. Anyways, next question. We're just going to go right back down the line, okay? Okay, Nicole? Yep. We're starting with number one again. You got it? Hi. One, two, and three. Okay. Describe yourself in three words. Oh, tell me it's ether. I won't tell you it's either then. Living in the universe. That was four, but. That was, okay. I broke I, rules. Oh, I don't really, okay. Living by the universe. Number two. Um, cultured, for sure. Um, I'd say um, I'm pretty mellow. Uh, and, um, um. This is great. Like, really great adjectives. Sarcastic. Okay. Then you'll, maybe you'll fit in. Who knows? I don't know. Okay, number three. I would say I'm social, motivated, and intellectual. Okay, so those are terms I like. Thank those you. Are, those are the good ones. What? But what? But what's wrong with that? <laughs> yeah, is there... We're going to move on. Okay? We're Don't define me. I think it's too late for that. Anyways, okay. Last, last question before I go back to Nicole, okay? I'm going to switch it up. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, I'm going to go with number two first. Mm. Okay. If you were a character on Law & Order SVU, which one would you be and why? Well, this is a problem because um, I've never seen Law & Order SVU. Yeah, me neither. I'm not, from, I'm not from Westchester, you know. I'm okay, not, let it be thing. known. Two and three have not seen Law & Order. What do, you, what do you want? I haven't seen it. What are you talking about? See. Yeah. Talking about how you're cultured. That's insane. Yeah, okay, number one. Uh, Who would you be? Yeah, I would boy. definitely be the eraser, um, the pencil that they use. Okay. <laughs> Whatever floats your boat. Anyways, I'm going to go back to Nicole now, okay? So you guys can just take a rest. Okay? Yeah. They all answered. This is Two of them haven't seen it. I haven't even seen it. Okay, well, that's your own problem. It's a show I mean, it's law and order. It's about crime. That sounds scary. I don't want to watch that. Okay, well. Good to know. So anyways, what did you think of their first answers? They were okay. Okay, well, well let's talk right. about number one. He's a little hippy-dippy, I think. Number what do you, one. Is that something you're into? I don't know. I'm trying to, you know, uh, peg his voice. I have a question for uh, all of them. For, well, well, let's, we'll get to that in a minute. I want to know what you think about their responses first. Um, number one was very artsy. Okay, I yeah. understood it. 
Yep. What do you mean you understood it, Nicole? I don't know. I don't know what ether means, so okay, well. I didn't understand that. I tried to make it make sense, but I don't understand. That's why I lied. I didn't understand. Okay, let's move on. Okay. Next number two. Two? Um, two sounds cool. Cultured. Got it. Okay, number three. Come on, moving on. Social. Yep. Social. That, that is, that's fitting. Okay. Yep. Got you. Okay, so what's your, do you have a question for all three of them or just one of them? All three of them. Okay. Do you want to start with number one and move down? Yeah. Okay. Ready? Are you ready, number one? Sure. What animal do you think you look like? Oh, I like that question. Uh, well, I'm not even human. So, uh, I don't know if I could really uh, talk about mammals like that. Uh, I feel like I feel like that's that's brutality. Okay, number two, please. <clears throat> um, I would consider myself um, a majestic golden eagle. Honestly, uh, I hold myself to that kind of standard, you know. So that's kind of what I feel like. Okay, okay, that's an answer. Number three. What animal I look like? Yeah. Um, that's a tough one. <laughs> I mean, I guess, can I just say monkey? Because I feel like I look most like okay, a monkey. I, mean, <laughs> I guess. So right, that monkey, one monkey it is. So, all right. It, it makes like sense to me. Are cool? Yeah, they're OK. They're OK. Yeah. They're good. I'll make it Could work. Could be better? I'll put it into the bank. It'll be OK. okay so you're going to think about those questions yeah, while I'll process. I go answer them some more? Yep. I answer that answer question. Them. They asking you questions? I thought this was my show. I, apparently, I want to be your match. So, anyways. Sick. Okay, I'm going to switch it up a little bit. I'm not going to start with number one, okay? Who are you starting with? I'm going to start with number three this time. Three? Yep, I'm going to start with three. Favorite member of NSYNC? NSYNC, Justin. Okay, I mean, that's commendable. That's fine. Is that yeah. the only well, person you know in NSYNC? Knows. It, isn't there like a, a Nick and an Aaron or something? I, I could like be mixing not. them up, but I know Justin's <laughs> I one of them. I think you're so. thinking of the Backstreet Boys, which is... I kind of get them mixed up, so I'm just going to stick okay. with Justin. Justin's a good yeah. pick. Okay. Good hair. Okay, we're going to go number one. Okay? Number one, what's your coffee order? A what? Excuse me? Your coffee <coughs> order. Can you say that right? Okay, guys. I think there's a language coffee barrier. order. I think there's Starbucks a language barrier. Tins. I don't know what... Or Duncan. Do you know what Coffee order. I don't know what she's saying, dude. Coffee. She's saying coffee. She's I've, saying speak, oh, I've she's spoken saying... a lot of alien languages. I can't understand this one. Uh, I'm not like number one. I can't. There's going to be a, a barrier. I think she's it's going to be a real problem. Coffee, yeah. She's saying coffee. 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 Like, coffee. like drinking. Like Why would you cough drink? in a drink? Dude. This is Westchester, suck. man. I don't know. It's coffee, for one. So tell me your order. Why are you coughing in a drink? <laughs> Who I does just, that? I can't help it. That's it's unsanitary. Just, I don't know what to tell you then. No, no, no. No, dude, like, like a coffee. Like, like a drink. Like from the bean, you know? like. Oh. Yeah. Like oh, like coffee. a drink. <laughs> like a drink. Yeah. I think you're freaking both Nicole and I out. What? What'd I do? Coffee. Like a drink. Do you want like us a drink. to say, you want a you drink? Want us to say coffee? Is that, no. Does that help? None of those make sense to me. I, you I said just, a Nicole, drink? Should I just like, skip like him? A, like a, skip okay, him I usually hand. only drink like Play-Doh. She, upset on the side she of drinks Play-Doh, yeah. guys. Yeah, that you, answers you all melt, you well, melt down. That's toxic, you know? You melt it down, you boil it, it's perfectly fine. Okay, it's got more nutrients we're gonna than go, anything we're else. We're going to go to number two. Okay, number two. English, please. You, I speak it. You got it the first time, okay? Jesus. Okay. If you could trade lives with anyone, who would it be? Um... You can just say me now. What? Why? <laughs> no, Mark Kayak. You know he's not going to watch the I show. Expi <laughs> oh, that's, yeah, I know. Okay, uh, Someone tried to um, I'm going to stick with Mark Kayak. I want Mark Kayak's life, you know? Okay. I aspire to be Mark Kayak. I'm, that's fine. Okay, I'm going to go back to Nicole. I need to process all of that that just happened. You didn't ask him a question. I asked oh, him what, you did ask him a what person for men sink, okay? Okay, number two's getting feisty over here. <laughs> they all sound feisty over there. I, Nicole, I don't know what to tell you. That's a mess over there. Okay. So, do you have a question for one of them or any of them? Hmm, let me think. Do you have time for one question? One question? Oh, my God. Um, I guess. 
If you could be a sandwich, what sandwich? Who are you asking? Hmm, I want to ask Remember number the three? artsy boy. The art, oh boy. Let's go the back to contestant boy. number one. What sandwich? San <laughs> sandwich. Sandwich. What sandwich would you be? Well, classic peanut butter and jelly. Oh my God. With a little paint dripped on top of it. Okay. That's good. <laughs> okay. Nicole. All right. It's in the bank with the other ones. <laughs> I have no words. Yeah, I'm running out of words too. Okay. So at this point, we got to eliminate one person. Oh, God. What do you think? What, tell me where you're at with all three of them. Where am I what at? Are you thinking? Um, I'm thinking one of them's got to go. Yeah, which one? That's kind of the point. Oh, what if I hurt his feelings? I, I think he's prepared for it. Do you want me to? This one. Number one? Yeah. You heard it here, folks. I don't have feelings, so it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> What's an I'm ether? Sorry. Don't know it. You're not cultured enough. <gasps> I don't oh, understand. He said it. Okay, so I'm just going to sit right here. You guys are left. You guys ready for this? You guys are the final two. Yeah. yeah, what if we're not? Let's do it. Okay, don't beat artsy now. All right, let's go. <coughs> that All right, let's go. Artsy. Let's do it. Okay, Nicole, we're going to move on. I'm going to ask the next question. I'm okay, ready. I'll be back. Okay. I'm just going to sit with you guys. This is fun. Sure. Okay. You can't sit there. That's for contestants only. Maybe I want to be a contestant. Nicole's my partner. This is what it feels oh. like to live at the zoo. The box okay. Thing. So, anyways, contestant number three. Guilty pleasure song. Song. <laughs> um, probably something Zach Brown band, like uh, Toes, maybe. I don't know that song. I, like, can you sing me a verse? It's a country, or like, beer drinking song kind of thing. So you're a beer drinker? I'll drink anything. Okay, just tell me it's not Bush Light. No, never. You don't like bush light? No. That's good. I'm proud. Well, anyways, so number two, your question. What, are, what is your number one pet peeve? Um, wet socks. <laughs> I'm just going to. Wet socks are the yeah. worst. Yeah? Right? Day. You agree right? with him? What? Yeah, they're the worst. <laughs> Ugh. I don't like wet socks. I don't think anyone can say they actually like wet socks, guys. Okay. You like them. I love wet socks. Sick. Anyways, Sick. I got to get to my last round of questions. Do you have any comments? What do you I think do. of those answers? I have. Well, I like the wet socks. Do you know who the Zach Brown band is? Is that? Did I say that right, contestant yeah, number no, three? Did yes. they sing that? Yes, you did. They sing a song. They sing a That's song. That's what bands do. <laughs> I don't know what song, though. He said toes. I don't know names of Toes songs. and wet socks. Perfect <laughs> combo. Anyways, I'm going to last question. OK. So <laughs> go do you want to add something? No, you can okay. do your thing, okay. you know. So I'm going to go to cont contestant number two, OK, Nicole? Yep. Okay, right. I don't think you're ready for this I'm question. I'm frustrated. Oh, this is okay. This is the deal-breaking question, guys. Well, for both of you, you're gonna have two separate questions. Okay. Contestant number two. Why do you think they use sterile needles when giving lethal injection? Oh my God! Why? Yeah. What's the point, right? Why do you think? Um. <laughs> this is supposed to show intelligence, and come on. Morals. Uh, question mark like but if they're morally and if the person receiving lethal injection are morally incompetent what's the point i mean they're kicking the bucket anyways I've you know, stumped so him. i don't know what to say okay okay we'll move on i've got another good one okay which one was that that was contestant number two all right okay you got it okay so now contestant number three can you please describe for me the color yellow as if I were blind. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Um, I imagine if you're blind, you can see some sort of light. I can't so, attest to that, so. Well, close your eyes. Okay, close and look my at, eyes, look guys. And look in front of you. I see a lot of light. You do see a lot of light. And there's this kind of, the brightest hue that you see in front of you, Okay. that's kind of like yellow. 
I don't know. I'm not really picturing yellow. That was a good mm. answer. That was a very good answer, but like I'm not really getting yellow from that. Mm. I mean, I could very well be seeing orange. Make her tell her That's kind of eyes. like a shade of yellow, but think <laughs> brighter. Okay, I'm thinking of a banana now. Anyways, okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're blind. You don't know what that is. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, Nicole, what did you think of those answers? What, good or not? Uh, they were not good, not bad either. I tried the eye closed thing. Oh, you it did? It made me a little dizzy on the chair over here. <laughs> um, me too. These lights are bright. Yeah. Um, what was the first question you asked? I asked him, why do they use oh, yeah. barrel needles? Who with came up with that there? question? Excuse me. There's a whole pot where I picked questions, I and it was a good question. Do you not like my questions now? That was an odd question. It. it was t telling us of his intellectual capabilities. Yeah, OK. And it didn't do its job, clearly. What? Well, oh boy. Can I ask another question? You've got time for one more question. Are you asking both of them or one of them? Both of them. This is okay. important. Great. I'm going to go so, them. Okay. Can I ask it? Ask them. So our number one fan, Hysterical Patrick. He has a chronic armpit itchiness. If I were right, to get right, the right. chronic mm -hmm. armpit itchiness, would you itch my armpit? No. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was contestant number two, Nicole. Wow. Um, I would encourage you to see a physician, but yeah. in the event that you needed a scratching, I might utilize some sort of scratcher to, to get the job done. Would you use like a fork or like a back scratcher? I would go so with more of a back scratcher yeah. method, probably. What if she has hairy armpits? You know, I'll shave them for her. Wow, <laughs> you heard it here, folks. <laughs> Jesus. She would shave her armpits. Good that was you. contestant number Good three, Nicole. <laughs> All right, was all that, right. Was that an answer you were expecting? Uh, I wasn't expecting any of those answers, actually. Wow. Answers you like or answers you don't like? I mean, I didn't think anybody would answer the question, so I'm okay, pretty well, satisfied. Do you, have, do you have one more question? Do you, do you need a little bit more information? I need a little more info. Okay. okay. Right. We got one more. Um, okay. Let me think. Let me think. Okay. I guess it would be... Have you ever been to Westchester? Okay, perfect question to end on. Have you ever been to Westchester? I don't even know where that is, to be honest. Yeah, I don't really. Might have been a deal breaker right there. <laughs> yeah, yeah that, really, at this point. Is that like Jersey area? I'm like assuming Jersey. Yeah. Jersey? No, it's New York. Oh. Ah. It's New York. There you go. So like Jersey area? I have no common. All right. So Jersey. Okay. All right, cool. Okay, Jersey. We're going with that. Jersey. Okay. That wasn't really the answer either of us were hoping for, I think. Yeah, I know. Okay, so I think it's, uh, if you don't have any more God. comments, it's time for you to pick. I got to pick? You're going to pick. Okay. And oh. guess, okay. Oh, when God. you pick, um, I'll bring okay. the contestant over. Okay. And you guys can go off on your date together. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. So I'm, I'm scared. Gonna, okay, you want to whisper to me and I'll say it and I'll go grab him or you want to just announce it? I don't know. I'm stuck between the two. Okay, well, tell, let's do pros and cons right now. Let's do a list. We got this. The one kid wouldn't scratch my armpit. If God That's, forbid I got that disease. You know, maybe Hysterical Patrick put it in our pillows or something. Like like pink eye? He told, he, remember he told us he has our addresses. He has a timeshare next to our house. Oh my God, I'm gonna die. Oh my God. Um. All right, and then um, they all didn't know Law and Order. That was good. How was that good? The Wet Sox was good. Okay. So the that other was one had two. toes. The, no, the other one likes song called Toes. Oh, <laughs> song called Toes. A little toes. bit of a difference. Okay, okay, and um, they never went to Westchester. No, nope. and they Who think said it's Jersey. Jer they both think it's in Jersey, but contestant number three said it. You said it? I think so. I don't remember. Who, Who said, said Westchester is in New Jersey first? Who said? Might have been me. I don't know. I don't remember. Who contestant knows? Contestant number two says it might have been him. Oh, boy. But I think contestant number three is looking a little suspicious. Okay. I think I've made my choice. Okay. Oh. What are you, you going to announce? You tell him. I'm just going to, I'm going to tell you. 
Are you guys ready for this? Oh, I don't know. I'm scared. Now, are we? She made her pick. Okay. Contestant number three. Come with me. Was there something like I... Was this gonna... Hi. How are you doing? This Good. Is... Nice to meet you. Alex. I've met you before. Yes, you have. I have. Wow. So are you guys ready to go on your date? Yeah. Or do you want to see contestant number two first? Or are you who, just happy? Who is contestant two? I'm just curious with okay. the wet socks. Well, come on over. You and Alex come, come, come over before you exit Can on I? your date. Who is it? Wow. Ah, you had no idea. I just had to do okay. So wow. now you guys can go off on your All right, have fun. I'm offended. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's okay. Grant. Awesome. Grant. Woo. Even though you've never been to Westchester. Good choice. <clears throat> Great choice. I'll forgive you for now as I fall off the chair. Fall. I've just uh, I've never, heard, never, never been hurt like this before. Honestly, this is this is real deep, real deep. I can't really say I'm surprised. But um, I don't like Jersey anyway, so. It's not New Jersey. Really? Do you want to close the show with me? Yeah. You are the sore it. loser. Okay. Well. Are you ready? This has been the Westchester Girls, Nicole's matchmaking episode. Until next week. Westchester Girls are in a different world. Westchester Girls.